On the opening stage of the Dakar Rally, Audi's Carlos Sainz and his co-driver Lucas Cruz demonstrated remarkable resilience and skill, finishing a superb second despite encountering three punctures along the way. Starting from 48th in the starting order, their performance was nothing short of miraculous, especially considering the challenges they faced during the stage. The stage itself, covering a distance of 414 kilometers and featuring new terrain for 2024, presented a diverse range of obstacles, from loose gravel to boulder fields and narrow mountain passes. The landscape, reminiscent of a Martian settlement, added to the surreal atmosphere of the rally's beginning. Sainz's teammate, Matthias Ekstrom, initially led the stage, showcasing impressive speed and precision. However, as the stage progressed, catching up to other cars led to dust and increased risk of punctures. Despite encountering a puncture and a minor detour, Ekstrom remained positive, recognizing the need for a cautious approach to preserve the car's condition. Sands, benefiting from clear terrain due to cars ahead sweeping away rocks, made a remarkable comeback, briefly leading the stage despite facing multiple punctures. His ability to adapt and persevere under challenging conditions highlighted the strength of both his skill and Audi's RSQ e-tron. Meanwhile, veteran driver Stefan Peter Hensel faced a more difficult day, opening the stage and encountering two punctures towards the end. Despite the setbacks, Sainz's turnaround served as inspiration, emphasizing the unpredictable nature of the Dakar rally and the potential for rapid change in fortunes. Overall, Audi's performance on the opening stage showcased their determination, resilience, and the impressive capabilities of the RSQ e-tron, setting the stage for an exciting and unpredictable rally ahead.